quiet Saturday morning in February on the corner of 17th Avenue South and 34th Street in South St. Petersburg. This is A.J. Ali, driven, charismatic, with a humble smile that puts everyone at ease. Ali is seeking redemption from a violent past that includes multiple stays in prison. Three times I tried to build a drug empire as a very young guy, and something happened at a critical point, and it was like the wind blew my car, house of cards down. That was the guy that came with the gun when you owed money. He hopes that if he can keep young people from making the same mistakes he did, the children in this neighborhood will have a chance for a better life. This corner is where our story begins. AJ Ali produces a public access show about the Young Entrepreneurs Mentors Program that encourages kids to make a future in the business world instead of the drug world or the welfare system. Welcome to Straight from the Streets. I'm AJ Ali, your host and producer. The title of AJ's show, Straight from the Streets, is both straightforward and metaphorical. A straight, AJ will tell you, is a passageway that delivers you from one place Place to another. This is what AJ hopes to give inner city kids with a public access show that speaks to the community the way commercial programs can't. In the language of the streets, straight from the heart. But a show by itself isn't enough for AJ. So on this February morning, he's organizing a flea market at the Second Chance Life Skills Center in St. Pete, hoping to attract kids, community attention, and perhaps some support. No one showed. AJ isn't deterred. The Young Entrepreneurs Mentors Program was actually born in Newark, New Jersey, uh, approximately 1995. We're all experiencing a uh, high rate of drugs in our communities. I mean, we had guys standing on side streets at 10 o'clock in the morning selling drugs right out in the open, not even hiding. The goal of the Young Entrepreneurs is to develop the future business owners for South St. Pete, to, to develop the future business owners for Pinellas County, to develop the future business owners for many other areas in Florida or even maybe across the country. Poverty breeds crime. In the ghetto, if, if a person has no hope, people have a tendency to give up on life. What we're doing is trying to restore hope with a plan. The fact that my grandmother was an entrepreneur and we had been in the restaurant business, it gave me an option. So when the time came for me to go back to a legitimate life, I had hope. What do others who know A.J. Ali have to say about his determination for the Young Entrepreneurs Mentors Program? How I know A.J. Ali, to know him or meet him once is to love him, <laughs> I must say. Yeah, A.J. is going to put a big part as far as his persona, as far as his drive. I think of A.J. Ali of a very good, strong man because I believe in people who have lived it and can walk the walk and talk the talk is a great thing. I think the Young Entrepreneurs Program is something that is sorely needed within the community and this serves a vital, a vital uh, role or plays a vital role in what we, what we need to do and that's to let young people know uh, the things that it takes to be successful. Undeterred by the lack of turnout at the flea market, AJ is back to the drawing board. He's organizing a block party. He brings a DJ and a stage. Like moths to a flame, the young people gather. AJ Ali is serious about his commitment to the future of kids. One of his recent shows features State Representative Frank Peterman. Another show is in memory of a young man who was shot to death in South St. Pete. The panel AJ's assembled is looking for solutions to stop violent crime. AJ Ali isn't just producing shows at Access Pinellas. He's producing changes in the community. AJ Ali is a producer with a purpose. Kids deserve a shot, says AJ Ali. He should know. He's been there. And just like the straight that leads from one place to another, AJ is charting a course for their future. We're doing it!